Well, I've got a new AR part here I want to show you guys. Now, how many of you have ever seen an AR gas block that's threaded? I'll be honest, this is my first one I've ever seen in the wild. Uh, this is the first one I've seen in real life in person. A few weeks back, I was contacted uh, by Saturn Barrel Company, and they wanted to know whether they could send me a part just to check out. And normally, I don't just say yes to every single person who asks me to try something out, but uh, I've, I've gotten a few different things from Saturn Barrel Company in the past, and I've really enjoyed and appreciated all of them. So I said, sure, send it on down. And um, I got this, and I'm like, wow, I, I know what a gas block is for, but I don't know what a threaded gas block would be for. So I contacted them to see what the thought process was behind threading it, and it shared two things with me. One, um, even if you don't use it for the intended purpose of what I'm going to tell you next, um, just this extra little bit on here with the rings and all that, it, I mean, it, it obviously will help a little bit in the process of, of heat dissipation. Um, but the intended purpose, why they threaded this was for the potential use of a, a reflex suppressor. So uh, after I said that to me, I immediately began researching reflex suppressors, and I did not see a single reflex suppressor that would thread onto a gas block like this. They, they were all threading on um, in like a barrel oversource situation where the, the suppressor would, if this was the barrel, the suppressor would go down the barrel like this and in somewhere, but they were still threading here at the end of the barrel. Thank you for being an example. <laughs> I, I Once again, I was wondering, is this part answering a, a question that nobody's asking? And so I, I contacted him back. And I'm like, hey, I, I haven't found any reflex suppressors that would would mate with a an AR gas block that's threaded. So if there is no immediate application for this, you know, I don't have the, the mythical reflex suppressor that would work with this. Um, why even review it? Why, why even put it out there? Well, one, um, like I said, this might be answering a question that nobody's asking, but it might be answering a question that nobody's asking yet. Um, for instance, some states have either banned or are in the process of banning threaded barrels, sort of as an end around to get away from flash suppressors, sound suppressors, all that kind of stuff. So if you were to build an AR with a threaded gas block, then all of a sudden, if there was a reflex suppressor out there that could thread on this, you would have an option to use on your legal non-threaded barrel. Another reason why to put a video out there like this, yes, that there is no reflex suppressor currently that threads directly onto the gas block. All of them just over barrel and thread to the end of the barrel currently. Well, you put the idea out there, maybe somebody with some ingenuity and some engineering skills says to themselves, hey, let's try to build something for this. And who knows, we may come up with a better suppressor. So just a few thoughts. Like I said, I don't have an immediate build for this, but you never know. You, you know how it goes, AR builders. Oh, honey, I've got this spare part. I got to make a build now. So um, I don't have an immediate plan for this, but hey, if you guys have some thoughts, throw them down in the comments below. Or if you have some thoughts for some uses for this, or if you know somebody in the suppressor community that would love to build a suppressor for this, I would love to hear from them. All right, until next time, God bless you. Go take your mountain.